So we try now to do an English speaking interview, even if we are German we try to do our best. And so um, I would, uh, it's very interesting, you're doing all your stuff alone, right? Yes, that's right. All your Nadia Lynn stuff is not produced by someone else no. or someone. You're doing it by your own. What are you using? What programs? Um, Start with the sequencer, for example. I, most of the time I use Ableton Live, as you see. Yeah. Here. Oh, wait. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We have a look here. And we have a screen recording also. Yeah. Okay. I think it's it's um, very easy to handle. Yeah. Um, and I like very much the way um, you can work with with Ableton. It's yeah. very intuitive. Um, how did you start uh, electronic music uh, producing? Mm, I started uh, with uh, Reason several years ago. And uh, I didn't know anything about uh, how to create music. A friend showed me a little bit and um, then I got this uh, version of Reason and uh, installed everything and uh, bought also a book, How To, and uh, uh -huh. sat down for uh, two days and three nights and really um, tried <laughs> so hard. Did you get angry? I, oh, I was so... I was so distressed and it was so <laughs> yeah. uh, annoying and um, uh, and and also very very sad and uh, yeah. but I I really tried to to get some some noises and some um, sounds out of this program <laughs> okay. and uh, yes finally I I managed to do some some nice um, sounds and. That um, yeah. yes. Why did you switch uh, from from uh, reason to um, able? Mm. A friend of of mine um, showed me Ableton uh, the first time. I I used to live in in uh, Mannheim, and. Um, on weekends I uh, drove to uh, Frankfurt, which is about 100, 100 kilometer from uh, Mannheim, to do some music with him in a studio in, in Offenbach. And he showed me uh, Ableton and uh, he told me, ah, oh, you have to switch to Ableton, it's so nice, and I show you how it works, and it's, it's a very cool program. And so I... Um, uh, he convinced me to to just try it, and uh, first I I used uh, Ableton as the master program and um, rewired Reason as a slave. So I had both uh, programs to, yeah. to work on. And so, what are your favorite plugins today? That is the most interesting question. What are you using? What's your mo most loved synth at the moment? Mm. My my beloved <laughs> zebra. Yeah. Um, Can you show it to us? Yes, of course. Is it in this this track too? Yeah. Uh, I think so. I'm I'm not quite sure where it is because it's it's a real mess. Ah, Here yeah, it is. Yeah. Here you see. So we can see a little bit from it. Yeah. It's uh, actually it's a zebra version two. Yeah. Which is a really nice um, synth because yeah. you have you have so many possibilities. I I don't know much about Zebra, but uh, but uh, the presets you have it's it's uh, enough already, or yeah. you, you just play around with it. But so you, you but as I understand you, you, you your process is very unique because you you record um, all lines. Uh, yes. And you send it to through, I don't know, several things. Is this correct? I mean, yes. Uh, I have my my own um, way of just producing some some new sounds. So I, for example, um, make some sounds with with uh, zebra and yeah. then uh, record 
recorded as an audio um, file and then I take this file and uh, for example I love um, yeah, sure. guitar rig yeah, sure. very much and I I hope native instruments um, is not um, will, will not kick my ass for this but I only use the demo demo version <laughs> uh -huh. um, because here you have so so many uh, possibilities for just um, modulating sounds with yeah. uh, weird um, distortion effects or reverbs and delays and all that stuff and amplifier uh -huh. and really really weird uh, I, I love for example this uh, ring modulator yeah. or phaser where yeah. is it stone stone phaser sounds very nice and yeah. there are uh, millions of, of uh, possibilities yeah. and then I, I record uh, the, the so to say Zebra audio file I um, put put this guitar rig on it and record it again and then I record it again with for example what I love also is um, the little volcano fab yeah, filter yeah show it too this is a, a really what, what kind of fab cute filter? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it looks cute, cute too, too, yeah. Very nice designed uh, plug-in. And uh, yeah, with that you mod modulate it even, even more. Yeah, so you, you yeah. just can, can modulate it like this. And, yeah. and do a little bit of, of playing around and then you hear yeah. how the sound is modulated. And um, I, I prefer... Um, to to modulate um, bass lines with with yeah. volcano yeah so you that get a deep, fe nice. deep deep feel or something like that uh, sub yeah bass. sub sub, sub yeah. bass uh. mm -hmm. so um, you are currently working on a new track yes and it is a very deep track again mm -hmm. and you put in some chords um, by your own. And uh, build a deep bass line that you cannot hear on the camera. No, I but I'll increase the volume. Yeah. And, <laughs> and yeah, you, you, let's talk a little bit about your Lucid Flow Seven, the release on Lucid Flow uh, Sunspots EP. Um, you got very positive responses on it. Is this, this true? Yes, yes. Um, I was very happy about the, the responses I got, yeah. really. Do you have some names? Do you remember? I don't remember even. <laughs> yeah, it was very, very much, I mean... Uh, I Silicon know. Soul yeah. and uh, Toby Neumann. Yeah, it Toby Neumann. Yeah. Ugel contacted you. Uh, Ugel, uh, <laughs> I don't know how they are spelled. Uh, from Italy. Me neither. They are on uh, Noir Music. Yeah. A, a label uh, which I really, really like yeah. very much. Ah, and and you did a did a mix for Itoka Records, right? You can sh just show your your arrangement what you already have in the moment, so that we see what what. What nice colors you have there, <laughs> and how well, it all floats. Well, I love blue and pink, yeah, as see you it. see. Yeah. <laughs> and ah, and you you bought a new new plugin, or? Yes, yes. You do mean you the organ? Yeah. Do you want to show it to us? Where is it? Here it is. This one I really love. What's the name? Do you know? Organ three. Ah, okay. At present. Yeah, and, and you play around it with it and send it through your your plug-in chain. Yes, it's. Uh, I use it uh, as a VST plug-in. Yeah. And uh, wow, it 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 is really a lovely tool to make uh, soundscapes and uh, and chords. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Really nice. 